GamerU, here again with another guide to the mighty quest for epic loot. Today we explore some of the more advanced ways to build your mage. If you're coming from just playing some archer and have grown fond of that style, I'd advise taking a look at the crowd control mage as your first build inspiration. As the name suggests, you use your abilities in the unholy rendition tree to keep your enemies in line and eventually incinerate them. Abilities like Fireball and Conflagration work best when comboed with Vortex Rift because it pulls them perfectly into your AoE, whereas Death Grip can get the most out of Volley or Flame Burst by keeping the enemies moving towards you, but at a very slowed pace. This build benefits from having Death Bolt in your arsenal to give you some extra shield if the enemies get too close, but that's for very rare occasions. The second build could arguably have the most damage output of any class in the game, and that's the Burst Mage. The Burst Mage is hyper-focused in keeping your enemies constantly vulnerable to magic damage and immediately punishing them for it. Usually, if you're fond of Electric Charge, you'll be using Flame Burst or Volley to punish them with loads of AoE Burst. Or if you like using Chain Lightning or Thunderclap, Bring Conflagration and Fireball to keep the damage constantly churning. Both of these Burst Mage builds require having Storm Armor in your arsenal, which keeps you healthy through any damage and makes the enemy constantly weaker to your flames. It really depends on how you like to play when it comes to the mage, because either way, you're going to be unloading an ungodly amount of damage. That's it for us here at GamerU. Check back later for more guides to your favorite games.